What we do oh. here is go back, oh. back, 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 back. Oh my god! Five ounce weight. Oh, they're making it. So I'm just walking down here and oh the net nice and I walk up and Ryan I didn't have any cameras out Ryan just hooked up with this nice wiper the nicest wiper I've ever seen in real life oh 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 my gosh he's pretty heavy dude <laughs> I got a scale I think oh man I don't that's a, yeah that's a hefty <laughs> Right on. That's my PB wiper right there. I know, I wish I would. Dude, that's huge. That's a good fit. Just, we need to, um, yeah, just get you with a picture of it and um, get that thing on the scale. That's, that's a 10 pounder. It feels heavy, yes. Got a big barrel. Look at that fish. Right. Sure, it's hard to tell on camera. Here. On the on the lipless crank that looks like a shad. I don't have pliers in my tackle box. I have pliers. Yeah. I have a little pair. That's why. It's on. I just can't. Oh, there we go. Look, the size of that fish. <laughs> Cheaper. Yeah. Right on. Here, Showing get get a backdrop of the. Showing it off for the rest. Yeah. Inner city fishing. That's a good fish. Yeah. What do you think he is? Nine pounds? Eight well, pounds? I'd say anywhere between seven and nine, probably. He's all seven pounds for fish. Good fish. Better take a pick with a phone so I can oh, send yeah. it to the idiots. I'm jealous. Of course he's ready to go. Oh yeah. <laughs> And that was he was standing right out on that log there. Where'd you cast to? Under the bridge? Yeah, I was or? going straight along the edge. Just close to the pillars. To the pillars? Here's here so I can get. Yeah. Probably, probably about five. I mean, minutes. look at this. He slammed it out in the middle. Look at this Eddie. Just slow cranking. Yeah. I'm gonna get a shad in and show him the size of our shad baits. Oh yeah. This is uh this is the old I inner city Iowa City shad Iowa that we River. catch. Shads. <laughs> I mean good night. Dude, I had a few. I had like one nib that was real yeah, good. Yeah, it didn't take it though. And then that one just Kawasaki. I bet, dude. I saw the hit. I saw you reeling, and then I saw you catching it. Yeah, yeah. Sure. I think there's a school up right out there. Oh, probably. They school up. Just heard a fish jump right there. Nice. Nice. You on camera? Yeah. Nice. On. Nice. I don't check and see if it's angled good. I'm not sure. I tried. To. Oh, yeah, it got you. Yeah. Getting on the wiper action. Yeah. Killer. You need the net? Oh, it's not as big as yours. I think I can get it. Okay. Well, it's barely hooked. Well, as long as you're not worried about your thumb getting nailed. No, not as big as Ryan's, but a fun fish to catch by all counts. Oh yeah, they're fun. <laughs> they're hard fighting little buggers. Do you got a bait out now? No, I'm getting I, yeah, I had an issue back here with some line. Totally 
spot, Jack. Do you have to get over there? Alright, so... Are you casting the map in here? Oh, uh, yeah, I'll probably... That's the map, I don't think. We're running, uh... This is just my particular setup here, I guess. Uh... 30 pound slime line, 15 pound big game, whisker seeker float, whisker seeker rattle, five ounce weight. Might seem a little excessive, but in the Moines River, you need heavy weights. I think that's a number, it's eight off. Circle hook and a big old chunk of shad that we're gonna see what happens here. The old uh, Alvaro Garcia catfish commander. I feel bad about that, man.
you see this in bad television. And that James Bond shit never happens in real life. Professionals don't do that. On camera. Oh man! Pretty much got everything on camera. Oh, all the from the swearing, beginning to the end. All the cussing. I I stopped it a couple times, but started it right away again. This that's just unbelievable, fellas. Oh boy! On the big old cut piece of cut shaft. Big head. Right oh, it was a head. Big head. Okay. Right in the corner of the mouth. And I'm okay. Maybe that's not a. That is a ten, ten pounds. Yeah. Ten. I overestimated him at first, but that's a ten pounder. Yeah. That's so cool. Got the rod back, got it all. Yeah. Oh, you deserve a kiss. Yeah. Mwah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. And go back, eat my shad now. Yeah. Live a live a good life. He didn't want to go. Oh, no. Oh. Oh. <laughs> here, let me just let, here. I got it. <laughs> nice. Well, don't stand on that log. Yeah. Remember that. Radical. Let's get another Next. piece of cut on there. Keep an eye on your rod. Yeah, I do. So it don't get sucked in. Nothing will bite my rod, trust Good me. Thing I brought two pairs of shoes for work. Oh, jumping Jehoshaphat. Look, can't believe. The audio is going to be bad, but we got everything on oh, camera. Man, alive. That. 
I'm so jacked. The line wasn't moving, and then I saw it was green, and I was like, I got it. Yeah. Oh, no, uh, so excited right now. Yeah. My uh, shin hurts a lot, though. There was rock under the water. Down the <laughs> what a fishing story, dude. Yeah. What a fishing story. It can all be green. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. No more hill swag getting spooled. Got a big wiper and a big channel. Yeah. Woo! I am jacked up right now. Holy cow. You gotta hold them, right? Don't, don't kill them. I'd say that's a six pounder, five pounder. It's a good fish. Real good fish. Slam the lipless crankbait. Pulled some drag on you too. Yep. Did I say it out loud or was I just thinking it? We have yet to caught a, a you, walleye. You just said that, yeah. Yeah, and then you catch it. Beautiful fish. Killer. She gone. They always splash you. Awesome. Happened. Yeah. We didn't see it underwater, you know. No. We got to talk to an expert how they behave when they get snagged. Because that fish was powerful and lively, like he was mouth hooked, and then yeah. the bite, it's like it. You know what I mean? Yeah. Well, you oh. Fight, you know? Oh. Ah. Dang it. Jeepers. Well, I've been casting there a lot lately. Uh, uh, fancy how to do the old uh, bow and arrow. I don't think it'll work. Oh, it, work. it always works for me. I got a whole catfish rig out with it. I don't think that's going to work this time. Oh, wow. Every time it did I work. It did work. That's unbelievable. It's a heck of that felt like a stick snag. It felt like a log snag. It didn't feel like a rock. And it, yeah. it popped that right like out. I told you, I got a whole no no weight, a flow, and everything. Nelson's like, that's not going to work. Get my rod out. <laughs> yeah. Like, well, out. Yeah, that was cool. You get a lot of guys in the snap. Yeah, but it snapped to the eyelids. Nelson does it too. He'll grab right in front of the reel. Yeah. And pull it all the way out of here. <laughs> yeah. Run it through seven eyelids. Yeah. Exactly. <laughs> if you really sit down and think about it, that makes no sense to do that. Yeah, the way the guy explains it, it makes perfect sense. Rod. Got another one. Maybe I'll go grab mine and start throwing it out here. It's a small, this is a small fish unless, oh, it's another walleye. No. Yeah, the walleye. Yeah, it's another walleye. I knew it was small because I, ah. No.